Investigators believe that a house fire on Grand Rapids southeast side was started due to a faulty generator. Black smoke visible for miles away. Thankfully, though, the family inside was able to make it out safely. Discovered a heavy black smoke. Uh, coming from the structure. Crews bursting on scene Tuesday afternoon greeted with a burst of flames. They can see the back of this uh, structure was uh, heavily involved in fire. Crowds gathered stunned by how quickly it grew. The family inside made it out safely. So what we're looking at right now is a generator that is very close uh, to the home. Grand Rapids Fire Marshal Bill Smith said they were running the generator close to the home under an open sided porch roof. Plumbed to the home for natural gas. Uh, typically a very safe operation. Investigators assessing the scene to determine exactly what happened, warning anyone without power to be careful when using a generator. We need to make sure that you're doing it in a safe operation. He says a generator should be no closer than 15 to 20 feet from the home. Thankfully, everyone escaped with their lives. We have one firefighter that's uh, been transported, possible back injury. Now, sadly, a family dog is believed to have died in that fire. The firefighter who injured his back is currently being checked out at the hospital. There was another fire believed to have been started by a generator. This one happening out in Ottawa County near Leonard and 8th in Talmadge Township. We don't have a lot of details, at least at this point, but what authorities tell us is it sounds like the fire was limited to the outside of the house.